carrying on with my barrel tutorials. In this tutorial I'll show you how to make an open barrel and in the next tutorial I'll show you how to fill it with gold coins. The starting point for this tutorial is the simple barrel shape with the material set up in cycles. You can make the file yourself or download it from my website. Change the shading to material, go into face select mode Select the face at the top of the barrel and press X on the keyboard to delete it. Select only faces and straight away we have an open barrel but we have two problems. It's a thin model, the walls are infinitely thin and the texture on the inside is the same as the outside and you wouldn't have metalwork on the inside of a barrel. Press A on the keyboard to select all. Now to give the walls thickness I could use the solidify modifier but I'm not going to. In the mesh menu faces solidify. Now this only gives us one parameter the thickness but that's the only one I want to alter anyway. If I change that to 0.1 the walls are a bit too thick. I'm going to go for a value of 0 0.08 there's a bit too much slant on the faces around the top of the barrel. To fix this I'm going to go into edge select mode, I'm going to disable proportional editing, I'm going to hold down the alt key and select an edge and that selects a ring of edges, hold down shift and mouse wheel to pan down, drag on the tip of the blue arrow to move the edges up and down and while you're dragging you can enter a value 0 0.05 and enter Next, I'm going to UV map the inside of the barrel and the faces around the top of the barrel. Go into face select mode, drag with the middle mouse button to rotate the view. Now this top face, as we look at it, has two horizontal edges. Now if I hold down the Alt key and click on a vertical edge, it selects the faces around the top of the barrel. Change the view to orthogonal. Change the view to the top view. Drag on the white diagonal lines to open up a new window and make the new window a UV image editor window. Click the material button and with the lid material selected click the assign button. Zoom back with the mouse wheel. In the mesh menu UV unwrap project from view bounds. Next, the inside of the barrel. I'm dragging with the middle mouse button to rotate the view and zooming in with the mouse wheel. Hold down the Alt key and select a vertical edge to select a ring of faces. Hold down Shift and Alt and select a vertical edge to extend the selection. Click on vertical edges, drag with the middle mouse button to rotate the view. Shift, Alt, vertical edges until all the inside faces are selected. For the inside of the barrel, I used this texture file, Wooden Floorboards, from this website, Myang's Textures, myang.com forward slash textures. I did rotate the image through 90 degrees using image editing software, though you could just as easily rotate the mapping in Blender. Click the Add New Material slot button, click the Add New Material button, and call the new material inside. Assign the faces to the new material. Click the dot at the end of the color box and set the texture to image texture. Click the open button and go to the folder where you have your floorboards texture, select it and open it. Press S to scale followed by X for the X direction to stretch the mapping and I'm going to enter a value of 2. Drag on the white diagonal lines to close the UV image editing window. Go into object mode, change the view to perspective, zoom back with the mouse wheel and there we have an open barrel. I'll put the start file and the end file for you to download at my website www.freemovies.co.uk at the Blender channel there. Thanks for watching and goodbye.